So what is a simple fraction? Let's have a look at the parts of a fraction and a couple of simple examples. So up until now we're used to our normal counting numbers. 0, 1, 2, 3, and so on and so forth. What is a fraction? Well, for the moment I'm going to tell you that a fraction is a number that's less than 1, but it's not 0 either. It's somewhere in between. So for example, you might be counting objects, and we actually don't have a whole object. The object is broken up or fractured into an even number of smaller pieces. And a fraction is the way of saying how many of those pieces do we have. So for example, a fraction looks like this. We have two numbers separated by a bar written vertically. The number on top is called the numerator, and the number on the bottom is called the denominator. So for an example, if we are counting pizzas, we can count whole pizzas, right? One pizza, two pizza, three pizzas, zero pizzas. What this is, it's just part of one single pizza, but it's not a whole one. And in English we say three over eight, or three eighths. But in some languages we actually read it bottom to top, which kind of makes a little bit more sense. The denominator, the number on the bottom, tells us how many equal pieces the whole amount has been cut up into. In other words, if it were a pizza, because I really like pizza. Mmm, I like it more. No, I like it more than you. No, I do. Quiet, I'm busy. So, if we were talking about pizzas, for example, the denominator 8 means the original pizza was cut up into 8 slices. And then we go to the top and say, well, there are only 3 of those slices left. So, in other words, we have three-eighths of a whole pizza. Let's have a look at another example. Another example might be five over six, or five sixths. Six. That's really hard to say. Come on, what's wrong with you? Get it out. I'm trying. Five sixths. I got it, I think. Uh, yeah, finally. So, for example, if we were talking about a bar of chocolate, the bar of chocolate would be broken up into six equal pieces, and there are only five pieces of the chocolate bar left. So in other words, we would have not a whole bar of chocolate, but five sixths of a whole bar of chocolate. So that's what a fraction is. It's simply a number that is not a whole number. It has been broken up into smaller amounts, and it's a way of showing exactly how much there is. Thanks for watching.